you you build puppets specifically because you're Geppetto on, aren't you? But I thought, well, are, are they going to be a master craftsman or a master engineer? Um, and you've got, you build a dummy that draws attention. So <laughs> you throw out Pinocchio uh, into the battlefield to take all the damage for you while you kill everyone, which is lovely. <laughs> Very nice. Build a dummy that draws enemies' attention and attacks them for damage. Geppetto can have up to three dummies built at the same time. Dummies can be dismantled using contextual action and will self-destroy if they're too far away. Okay. Oh, so the dummies actually do fight for you as well. That's cool. That's cool. Um, you've got your hammer, which is just dealing damage. Dummies hit, so you can repair the dummies to heal them, which is really interesting. So this is going to be a lot of uh, micromanagement, I think, which sends up my street. Not micromanagement in terms of Beowulfs. That was a bit much, but more run around hitting the dummies, repairing them, attacking people. Um, uppercut, deal damage. Closest dummy hit is displaced and deals 50 damage along its path. Ooh. Cog explosion. Hold then release to roll a bomb that explodes after a short duration. Deal and damage. Dummies hit are healed. Interesting. Defibrillation. Apply a shield on Geppetto and all dummies. Briefly grants intangible. Wow. Wow. Because I did think, is Geppetto going to be like a support class? Am I going to really need to be playing with someone else to see Geppetto in action? And no, it's, it's very solo oriented. <clears throat> You, you're bringing your friends to the game. To Ooh, what was that? Friend. Reduces pericle then? Might need that. Robot talent we're getting. Dummy ball. Special creates a dummy when it explodes and deals 100% damage. Wow. Wow, no effects on max number, right? But that's really good. That's really good. Dash can be held for up to one second, dealing four damage along its path to the planet ignite. This is rare, but dummy ball seems better. Oh, let's go rocket science. I use the wrong ability? Yes, that was my defense, not my damage. Oh, wow, okay. So my dash is a little backpack, which is cool. Let's send a dummy out. There you are. Pinocchio's, uh, Pinocchio's doing his thing. Wow. And I can destroy it if I go up to it. That's cool. This is really cool. Wow. Really, really nice. I'm... I'm a fan of this, honestly. I I do love how Geppetto has a little um a little jetpack as well. That is so cute. Oh, also not little Pinocchios. I think, judging by Geppetto's uh, voice line there, Pinocchio's dead. Or what? What was the lore of Pinocchio? Did did Geppetto have a child who died? Um. I know, I know Pinocchio is quite a dark story, isn't it? As most classic fairy tales tend to be. Um, we'll find out when we level up, I suppose. We'll find out. Uh, we need to get the dummies out ASAP. Get a shield for myself and my dummy. Get a bomb out. Let's try uppercutting the dummy. There you go. Sends it away and deals damage. I think that ability to have your dumb, uh, bomb spawn a dummy would be really nice because I didn't realize just how much... I'm almost dead. How much damage the dummies take and how quickly they die. Alright, Pinocchio. You can come back with me. Can I avoid fighting and just heal up, please? Thank you. Oh. That's not what I wanted, but that's fine. Whee! Let's do this fight for the chest here. Bomb it. Another dummy. Another dummy out. Thank you. Let's uppercut you through them. Oh, there you go. Man, she's got a finisher there. Very nice. Let's heal you up as well. I 
A lot going on with these powers. A lot going on with these powers, but that's okay. Increase maximum active dummies by one, and they recharge faster. That is really nice. Wow. Yeah, Geppetto is, uh... It's, it's a lot to learn. It's a lot to learn, but I think, I think I'm a fan. I think I'm a big, big fan. This playstyle is what I wanted. I don't, do they expire after time? No, just if I'm too far away. So that's fine. Oh, there, there you go. That was too far away. So I, they, they can't, they basically can't leave my screen. Which is frustrating, but I get it. No, heal up. Take, take some shield. Here's another dummy. It looks like they don't disappear if they're actually in combat with enemies in your proximity, which is also really nice. Yeah, this is good. This is fun. Uh, what do we want here? Dream shards. 120 dream shards is nice, actually. That could buy something lovely from the shop. Uh, anything else around here while we're here? We've got a teleport station here. Can we go down here? No. Uh, there are shards here, though. Send a bomb out. Send another decoy out. Let's uppercut you through them. Send a bomb to heal. There we go. And also deal damage. Another shield. You get shields very quickly. Yeah, I do like the, the defensive ability actually applies to the the dummies as well. It's a really nice touch. Um, also, observation station. I have found it. Get these crystals. Don't mind me. I'm just uh, trying to get to the observation station. Oh, I'm getting to fight people actually. Nice. Shield. Oh, I've only got one dummy out now. Bomb it. Uh, they're gonna explode. My pure dummy! Pinocchio! Alright, one Pinocchio is dead. The other Pinocchio is alive. There we go. Anything near me? Oh, there is a health station, which is good. Um, dummies gain 4% of Geppetto's vitality. Geppetto gains plus 5 armor per active dummy. That sounds really nice. Or an additional strike to attack up. I think I want to go defensive. I think I want my dummies to deal most damage and my bombs and stuff. I know it's not as fun, but I think that's the best way to build so far. How much time do I have? So much time. So much time. Unlock this. Let these people start coming towards us. Another dummy out. I shield them. Get a fourth dummy out. Hit them into them. Nice, nice, nice. Wow, that's great. Fantastic. Fantastic. No one to spawn here, please. Thank you. Didn't mean to do the bomb, but that's fine. Let's shield everyone preemptively. Get another one out. Ignore the spider, let's heal you up. Hit you into them. Ooh, they might die here. It was close. Meant to get that bomb out to heal them, but oh well. That's all my dummies gone. I really need to upgrade the trait that makes the dummies um, cool down a bit faster. Because I'm really relying on having as many as possible. Oh, the dummy just saved me! That, that guy would have killed me with that Grand Slam, I think, because I do not have a lot of health. But uh, I think I think the dummy literally just stopped that from happening, which is really nice. In response, I'm whacking them away completely. <coughs> Unfortunately, 
this close to finishing the grimoire in just a bit too much time. We'll come back to the healing station here. Healing well, thank you. Another observation station down here. Almost dead. There we go. Just chuck the dummy into them. That does it. That does it. Uh, boss wave here. Not boss wave, but definitely enemies. Didn't mean to send you that far away. Uh, now you're despawned. Managed to keep this dummy alive enough though, which is good. Definitely let's send you away now. Shield everyone, including myself. Thank you. How about one of these? How about one of these? Send out a dummy. Send a bomb. Uppercut. Dummy and then we shield. That's a decent amount of damage with that uppercut there. Nice. Oh, not nice. We're uh, we're attracted attention. Oh no, my dummy, <laughs> my Pinocchio! I came to heal you, but I was too slow. There we go. Let's go to this observation station here then. What do you have for me? Ooh, quite a few things. A chest, a tumor, which I definitely want to go to. Uh, let's avoid these enemies. Pogo Hopper's dummies move farther when attacking, which could be really good because they don't move that well right now. Or when everyone's destroyed, Geppetto and dummies gain strength. Oh, that could be really good because they, they do get destroyed fairly quickly. They do get destroyed fairly quickly. Also, this jetpack trait or talent is really nice because I believe it extends your dash as well, which is really, really good. Send you there. Shield them. Get another dummy out now. Nice. Not one died, so no increased strength, but we don't need it, which is nice. That's going to be more effective in the boss battles, where... Um, let's reduce prices. Where the dummies are going to be dying left, right, and center, actually. Um, so we're going to get even more strength during the bosses, which is great because that's where we need it the most. Get these crystal shards. Thank you, dummy. I may even visit the Sandman before the boss fight if we've got time. Because we've got a lot. Ooh, tree! I am not a fan of these trees. Make me proud. But our dummies are put in the effort. Nice. A couple of spiders left, but that's fine. Get some dummies spawned here before we deal with the tumor. <laughs> Excuse me. I like that they're in the uh, little cutscene there, to be honest. That's quite nice. Uh, don't like these guys. Oh, don't like the healer, actually. Let's heal to you guys first. Uh, the other two have despawned, unfortunately, but that's okay. The other three have despawned, but that's okay. Another one out. Shield ourselves. There we go. Nice. Got another one out again. That is probably my main issue with Geppetto so far is just how the dummies despawn when they leave your sight. But in an area like this, they go, all my dummies despawned. But we got such a large area. And the boss battles are a bit too close where it won't really make a huge difference. But here. It definitely does. Get all my dummies out. Shield. Another dummy out. Let's 
send a dummy that way. Let me deal with the spider while my dummies attack. Get another dummy out. I can definitely see the, the bomb spawn in a dummy being incredibly useful in hindsight. Just just even with the uh, line of sight despawn issue alone. Um, yeah, that, that would be huge. Alright, one more battle. Get a stun, that's you dead. These stummies have just annihilated the spider. Let's send a bomb out to heal. And deal some damage. Some are dying with the acid, unfortunately. Not much I can do, but now that one's actually died, not just despawned, I do get extra strength, which is really nice. Back you in there. Whack you in there. Jeez, nice. The the uppercuts on the dummies is really strong, I won't lie. Really, really strong. I'd love to find a talent to upgrade that more. <coughs> Excuse me. That'd be really, really nice. Uh, let's avoid you guys completely, please. Thank you. Extra dash charge would be really good too, especially with the jetpack. Right, lots of crystals up here, so I'm gonna have to fight those pigs earlier. I think they're gonna come up. Yeah. So I have possibly made this fight a lot harder than it should be now. But that's okay, we'll have a challenge. Oh, not when it's a butcher pig. Not when there's a butcher pig, actually. Because that meat claw is really annoying. Let's send you into them. Let's send you into them. That's one dead, so we get extra strength. I'm probably going to die here, though. Yeah, that's a shame. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> it's not as bad as Beowulf needing a feather used left, right, and center. At all, actually. We do level up as well. What health do we get? Great autonomous puppet that will attack those targets for the follow Chapel if they're really nearby enemies. I'm using that straight away, actually. Whoa, 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 I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I can't use it at all. Jeez, oh. Whoa. Oh, wow, jeez, look at that puppet. Mecha puppet? My goodness. Can I uppercut you into the spider, actually? Oh, <laughs> I can. Wow, that's nice. Um, I think that Raven Feather was worth it just for the amount of crystal we're getting here alone, honestly. Um, so how long does this mecha puppet follow me? Just until death, or...? That's what I want to know, because this is really nice. I should have spent, spun you into that, actually. Okay, now. A, a decent amount of time. A decent amount of time. 40 seconds, yeah. That is incredible. That is incredible. We've got a raven feather here, so we can just buy that back. Um, which is fine. We still have a net profit on crystal from buying it back. I'm just going to put a puppet out to distract you. It'll despawn anyway. It'll despawn anyway. Am I far enough here? No. Uh, it's a butcher pigs. It's a butcher pigs. The only thing about Geppetto, which is a bit of a shame, is your direct damage output isn't that great. Um, obviously that can be changed. We had the option to, like, finishers deal 400% more damage. Um, so the playstyle is obviously not going to be for everyone from that alone. But I like it. It's, it's quite fun to have a support role while playing solo. It is really it is a support role since your damage is done from whacking bots into people and oh, we've got another. Do I do I go for the Raven Feather? Or do I go for the um, the other tumor? I think the Raven Feather is far more valuable. I think I'm gonna do so much damage with my Mecha Bot on the boss <coughs> alone that I need the Raven Feather instead. Uh, I need to summon bots. Finish these people off quick. Quick, 
quick, quick. Unless I can just avoid the attack altogether if I run away this far. That do it? No. Don't have time to kill. Don't have time to kill. That didn't take long at all anyway. Nice. Very, very nice. Thank you. Uh, I could buy experience. Does it tell me how much it will give me? No. Let's see how much it does. Uh, that wasn't worth it at all. 200 gold? That was not worth it. In the slightest. Not worth it in the slightest. But now we know at least how much it gives us. Not enough. I'm still in combat apparently. What about now? I'm going to see if I can quickly purchase something from Sandman. Oops. Oh, I used my ult. I didn't mean to reduce a power cool down. That's actually really good. I will take that. I will take that. Um, let's then travel here, see if our mecha bot comes with. Probably doesn't, huh? That's a no. I'm, I'm sure our mecha bot recharges enough once we're in the boss fight. It'll be fine, everyone. It'll be okay. I'm going to set my bots here, though, immediately. They are just going to die once the boss spawns, but that's not not a huge issue. Oh, one's dead already, because they're technically off my screen. The others that I've set up are also off my screen now, so that's a shame. Not really working as well as I'd like it to. Chippetto's fun, but definitely some annoying little tidbits here and there around the dummies. Bravo, my mm, take him to too much damage. Thankfully, they recharge instantly, almost. Mostly due to this trait, but... When you have that, it's it's a bit left of an issue. In all honesty, still frustrating though, right? And we do have our ult in time, extra strength as well, because a bot died. I meant to hit you through there. Oh well, there we go. Wow, that's a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage. Jeez, oh. Jeez, oh. Did I die? Oh, okay. I didn't die. I won. I think, okay. <laughs> I think I died right as I killed the boss. Uh, no worries, Tall Slashy. Thank you so much for the raid and thank you for hanging out. Really appreciate it. Um, hope you have a wonderful rest of your evening and thank you so much again for bringing all your wonderful, wonderful community over. I really do appreciate it. Thank you very much again. If you're not already following Slashy, definitely do. Highly, highly recommend it. Especially with like roguelikes and little indie games, you're in no short supply there. Um, Yeah, I think, I think I killed the boss while I died and that's why I had that interesting little cinematic. But as my death animation was still playing, the boss Got killed presumably by my dummy. Uh, I should have time. I might have time. I think I was going to stream DVD tomorrow. Um, so I could swift non comms if you like. Uh, just because I'm busy evening beforehand. Sunday I'd definitely be free off stream though. But yes, regardless, I would, I would love to swift in the Halloween event with you at some point. 100%. 100%. And then when 2v8 is coming out. That too. By uh, absolute, absolute on, on my to-do list. <laughs> but yes, let's, uh, let's, let's get something organized. Because I've not tried the Halloween event yet. I was considering streaming it, but I got the key for this game three weeks ago. And I've just not been able to stream it due to tech issues and not being able to stream with fatigue. Um, 
I'm glad I swing this instead, but I'm, I'm excited to try the Halloween event. It looks interesting. It looks very, very, it looks so much better than the last one. The last one was okay. First iteration, that's when, that's when they started to actually add content to the, the events, right? It was, it was fine, but this one looks, looks better, looks more fun. So I'm excited to give that a bash. I'm very, very excited to see how it works. Alright, there's a teleport point. We've got a Grimoire here as well. I might do the Grimoire before the chest. Oh, we need to get these eggs gone, actually. Didn't get the eggs gone. Again, we don't have good damage output outside of the puppets. So, uh, not going to be able to finish them off on time, which is fine. It's fine. It's just a little frustrating part of Chappelle, as I've said before. We're gonna alt here. Does my alt work on you, or my shield work on you? It does. Okay, wow. Use a feather. Oh, my alt's gone immediately, isn't it? That's a shame. That is a shame. Boom, fish bash bosh, send out a bomb, get more strength at least, which is nice. My puppets are too, well none were there because no other puppet was up during that top, uh, point. Uh, kill you, kill the boss, Jin of course, first. Didn't manage to beat the Grimoire in time. That's the other thing because the puppets feel like, you know, force of attrition more than anything. It feels like it takes too long, at least with this current build, to get things done. Fun! Definitely fun, but I think Geppetto, I was saying, feels like a support character for single player without actually helping other people, so felt like it would be a purely support. Um, not the case. I feel Geppetto really to shine. You need someone else to be dealing a lot of damage output. Maybe I've just not mastered Geppetto yet. Maybe I've just not mastered Geppetto yet. Jeez, I'm taking damage. That's the issue. I shouldn't alt yet, but these crabs are scary. These alt uh, crabs are scary. What traits do we have? Nail and strike adds an additional strike to the attack, which will help a lot. Pogo hoppers, I think I want. That may help. Um, with the off-screen issue, to be honest. So we'll try that. They are moving really far. Yeah, they are moving really far. So they're actually going to be able to start attacking people more consistently now as well, which is good. Since, again, they're like my main source of damage. You're going to want to make sure they're dealing damage and hitting enemies. You know? And not just relying on your uppercuts to do so. So I think that was a good trait to pick up. 100%. And yeah, the uppercut is just essential to deal any damage as well. Granted, you actually hit them in time. It's, it's not worth using as a s attack on its own, I don't think. Um... But definitely worth using on the dummies. Okay, it does it does it does help with the crystals as well, the shards. It does a decent amount of damage, I suppose. And not as much damage as this. Wow, okay, yeah. Hundred percent not as much damage as that. There we go. I mean, the uppercut is fine when you have to use it, but again, it's just overall not worth using unless you are throwing a dummy across the across the screen. Obviously, the downside is you throw it too far across the screen, it's gone. Too 
too far and you're you're waiting to respawn them. That one two combo with the uppercut and the dummy, really nice. Really, really nice. There we go. Nice, so that's in bad. This may be easy. <laughs> I was going to say this may be easier because the bait attack to eat might target the dummies instead of me and obviously immediately get eaten instead. Which uh, ain't too good. Let's send out our little, our little helper here, huh? Who's immediately dead? No, just thrown away. Okay, we are just getting eaten constantly. We need to stay away. Just need to stay away. That's my alt gone as well. Not good. Oh, there we go. That's nice. Now we can just all attack. That was a decent amount of damage. I just need to stay away. It looks like the the dummies aren't affected by the bite attack at all, which makes sense. It's not going to get a dummy, but very good information to have in mind. All right, that sucks. Uh, so just with that second bit alone, we're one hundred percent not saving Sinbad here. Unfortunately, um, just. Yeah, that's that's it for the run. Not for the run, but well, it is using up quite a lot of raven feathers as well. Yeah, that's that. That's that. Oh dear. Not good. Not good.